Kaish just texted me and uh, said, while we are in New York, need a fire pick and NY with them. Kaish? These shoes are fucking ugly. <sighs> what is up, YouTube? Welcome to Starlife and welcome to another video. Today, we're going to go over this week's Supreme collaboration, which is a collaboration with Jordan Brand. Now, I know some people will be like, oh, you're just being negative. No, I promise you, there are a lot of things that Supreme has done, even this season, that I have loved. In fact, I will unbox a couple items from a recent collaboration that I really, really appreciate from Supreme in just a moment. But before we get into that, I do want to say uh, this collaboration, personally, not for me. It is garbanzo beans in fact i saw it on kaisa's story kaisa's talked about it several times and then i replied to a story one time i said these are so ugly he said nah flames story behind them is dope so i asked him what is the story behind them he then linked me uh, a photo that i believe supreme leaks news also posted of michael jordan in this uh jacket or studded jacket and um <laughs> they're just bad i just i don't i appreciate a good story behind a shoe However, with these shoes in particular, they just look ugly. It's not that cool of a model. I can say, to remove my own personal bias, I'm not really a fan of this Jordan silhouette anyway. So this is a shoe that I'm going to say I think is ugly, but I am genuinely curious what your guys' opinions are. And the reason for that is because I'm not a big Jordan fan. So if you guys are Jordan fans, oftentimes I'll get differing opinions from people who are fans of this shit. And it's just kind of cool to get that opinion because I often hear like different stories as to why you guys like it. And for me, that's really enjoyable. Anyways, I responded to Kaisen. I said, oh, that's dope. You know what they should have done though? He said, they should have did it on a Jordan 1, 3, 4, 5. They picked the worst model. I said, nah, bro. What they should have really done is throwing them in the trash. I will say, giving credit to Kais, I did see him posting some sick ass shoes on his story and he put me on these right here, these Nike SB Dunks. And these are actually on StockX right now for like right around retail, I believe. What was retail on these shoes? It's the Corduroy Dusty Peach. And I promise you these photos on StockX do not do them justice, but these shoes are so sick. Super killer deal on StockX if you guys want a dope pair of shoes and you guys also agree that these Jordans are trash. For those of you guys that do not know what StockX is, StockX is a great online platform to buy and sell brand new Supreme and brand new shoes. So this is the perfect drop to be discussing StockX. I really don't think these will do that well, although at the same time, I don't, I don't know, man. I just, I, know, I feel like they're gonna make too many of these. I feel like there's not a whole lot of hype around them. I'm going to be posting a story after this video asking your guys' opinion. So definitely go follow me on my Instagram. If you guys do not follow me already, my Instagram is at the start of this, T H E S T A R R L I F E. It's gonna be somewhere on the screen and in the description below. But let's get into these packages, baby. Um, and then after that, maybe I'll go get some of my classmates' opinions because uh, I'm kind of curious what they think of this collaboration as well. And it's my last day that I actually have to go to school. But. As you guys know, Jordan is owned by Nike, but Supreme did do a collaboration with Nike recently that I absolutely love, and it is this right, oh my god, and I got a shoulder bag too, Ooh Double cart, baby. Anyways, I got the shoulder bag. Let me just unbag this real quick. One of the better shoulder bags they have dropped, these were only $45, which is a super killer deal, especially since a lot of their waist bags have gone up in price. I love the colorway, I love the inspiration. Supreme Copies posted the inspiration. It literally is like a rip off of an old Supreme Nike bootleg, which I thought was kind of cool because I literally said in the video that it's a copy of a bootleg or it looks like a bootleg. Then we have the jacket. Now, random fact, <laughs> when I called Paul and I showed Paul, for those of you guys that do not know who Paul is, that's Paul Cantu, the thrift god. He loved the jacket. So then I called him afterwards and I told him about the drop and he was like, yeah, I copped uh, two jackets. and. At first I didn't believe him because he doesn't know, he doesn't understand that like you have to have two cards. But the sell-out times weren't crazy so I was like, uh, maybe he did. And then like he really had me going thinking he caught two jackets but he slept in and forgot. But anyways, so this jacket right here is oh, all embroidered on the back. So freaking clean. You have that green, red Nike check right there. You have tons of little Nike branding on the hood. And then of course on the back you have that definite bootleg Nike logo rip. Nike right there, Supreme right there. Super fire piece. It's a thicker jacket for sure and one that um, will stay in the personal size medium. And then I got pants of course. Now the pants are so fire. Um, I don't know how these items are doing on uh, StockX. I haven't really checked. I will probably put those on the screen as I show these items off. Um, but yeah, these are so sick, size small. I'm hoping they're not too baggy, but they are Supreme pants, so they probably fit like shit, which is why I always go for a size small. Um, 
I don't know. These these are filthy though. Oh my god, these are so hard. And I have the sickest shoes to get photos with these pieces in. So definitely, if you do not follow me on Instagram, change that. This is perfect though, because I actually need pants that I don't have any fucking pants on. Hey, these don't fit half bad, boy. Let's go over here. What do you guys think? <laughs> don't mind my pretty feet. But anyways, what do you guys think of the fit? Overall, I do not think the fit is that bad. This is obviously like a thicker coat. I feel like the suit is actually not too shabby. I don't know. Anyways, real quick, we are going to go to class, finish a presentation. I'm going to get my classmates' opinions of this Jordan shoe. All right, this is super random, guys, but these are two of my groupmates uh, for Capstone, right? So we're all graduating. But I'm going to ask them their opinion of this Jordan shoe. Siri, don't get on here right now. What do you think of this shoe right here. I like it. I like you the like co it? color combination between white Which and Which one do you like better? White or black? I think I have to go with the white one. I, I don't like it only because it looks like a, it's like bedazzled, you know that? All right, Anna, I need you to do me a favor. I need you to look up supremenewyork.com. All right, go to the news and now look at the shoes, the Jordans. Uh-huh. And then go to them and then let me know what your opinion is. Are you gonna get it? I, uh, mm, what's your opinion? I think they're pretty lit. You think they're lit? Yeah. You fuck with them? Which ones do you like better? I like the red and the white ones better, yeah. but I'm not a fan of either of them. I'm not a fan of Jordans though. So oh I'm kind of curious what everyone else thinks. All right, my last group member to ask. So, what is your opinion on these shoes right here? They are Supreme Jordans. I just have a question. Are those perforated or are those studded? Those are studded. What? <laughs> <laughs> There's this brand called a Neen Bing that I like, but neen I can't- Bing? A, a Neen Bing? Oh, I've not heard of that brand. Oh, anyways, it kind of makes me think that she designed these, and I, that was just, I just can't see guys wearing that. You think the studded is a little bit feminine? Oh my, well, I've seen guys pull off studded, but I think the way that is designed here is it's passively studded passively studded you're very good at articulating your opinion <laughs> maybe you should have a youtube channel where you talk about your opinions of jordan's because you are very good at articulating your uh description of the supreme jordan's but your overall opinion what would you rate these out of 10 uh four four okay so uh basically supreme you have failed Anyways, YouTube, thank you guys so much for watching. I know it's a little bit different. Normally, I do not leave my room and ask for others' opinions. However, I have a group assignment today, so I need to think of a way to make this a little bit more enjoyable. Hey, guys, how you doing? Anyways, um, make sure you subscribe down below. Like this video. Like I said, check out StockX, which will have a link in the description. And, of course, last but not least, follow me on Instagram at the start of T-H-E, S-T-A-R-R-L-I-F-E. My allergies are acting up, so I apologize if there's any snot in my nose. But, anyways, peace the fuck out. Bang, bitch, holla when you feel this. Fresh about the county, tell them hoes to get up on me. I was in that motherfucker with some killers